if you are real, you get no deal. That's how the world is. I'm talking how the world really operates. I'm not talking about you applying for a job. Of course, you're going to look at your qualifications here and there to see if you are fit for the job or they look at your work experience. That's on the local, small level. But I'm talking about people that want to make it in the world. They want to get rid of this yoke of employment. They want to make it become successful on worldly terms. If you want to make it on worldly terms, you have to be fake. Because only the fake are allowed to compete in the world's competitions. And even those competitions often are fake. I said it before. So if you are real, why are you looking for a deal? I said, say this again, because some of you just don't get it. You look at the appearance that the world gives onto you. But the appearance is a deception. Why? Because the appearance is intended to make you feel bad about yourself, so that you will begin to doubt yourself. So now you will look for the compensation that the world is offering you, which itself is fake. So you are conditioned to chase after the fake and for faking the real. And by for faking the real, you are now betraying yourself and you're now in disagreement with Christ, which means that you're open to the paranormal and you have lost pers you've lost perspective and now you begin to draw all kinds of bad circumstances and bad relationships onto you. That is what happens when you take this world seriously. Yes, you are in the world, so you have your job, you have your family, you have, you have the things you do, you pay taxes, so there are practical stuff that you consider, consider because they're practical. But please, don't take this world ser seriously, man. Really, don't. I said it one more time, because you need, to, you need to understand this. If you are real, that means you are naturally minded, as Christ intends. Even an unbeliever can be a bit natural minded. If that's you, you get no deal. Only the fake, only those that align themselves with the beast are promoted by the world. Yes, that's the truth. That's why many of those celebrities, when you, when you look beyond their success, their fame, it's all fake. Even the talent they so-called have often isn't real. And many of them aren't even the sex they claim to be. They've been secretly transgendered and presented as the opposite sex to, to deceive the masses. They have a psychological impact on the youth. Well, those who worship Apollo do such stuff. So, why are you who want to agree with Christ, want to be real, why are you looking for a deal? Why would you even want a deal of the world if you are real? Look, you can have agreements with other people, that's how you are at the job, that's how you make a career, that's how you make a, make a living, okay, I, need, I want to stop saying that, but that's how you operate in the world. But getting a deal of this world system, why do you want that? Please evaluate your expectations because somewhere you still think that this Apollonistic misery that they call the world is going to be worth it somewhere for you. So you still need deliverance in that area. Well, that's it for now. Agree with Christ and be at peace.